survive. So I'm going to say you were born in 72. 72. And then you said 1980. That's a freaking big range. You think in 1970? I know in the junior program, you were just a couple of years past me, so you can't be that much younger than me. So. Okay, and you were born in 1970. Okay. He was born in 1970. Um, so this, my hair looks like shit. Okay. And then um, you were born in 1970. Right. Uh, James Knight, I guess met him. Hi. Hi. I'll send this to you. Okay. Great. Okay. Cool. Okay. This is cool. You're a magician. Mentalist. 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 You're going for a mentalist side. Yeah. I'd love to I'd like to see it. What year were you born? Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. We gotta finish the loop. Right. Okay, what's what's the loop? So you said nineteen eighty. Yes. And you said nineteen seventy two. That's like eight years different. You weren't gonna see nineteen eighty like him, but I I knew you back then. Yeah. You can't be that much younger than me. Right, okay. So if, if I was nineteen seventy two, that means I would be what? Uh forty nine. Uh, would, would be forty nine. I mean, yeah, forty nine or fifty. Fifty years old, right? And then you said for nineteen eighty, so that means I would make me forty two. Okay, forty two or fifty. 1974. You're two years off. You're, you're, that's pretty cool. Okay. Good. Okay. Yeah. That's cool. That's great. All right. I had to document that. I got a mentalist here. Yes. But you know, I did get the 26. I said May 26. I said May 26. I said what? What? Um, so, like, what's my year? You're not gonna get the, the date. I mean, that's a pretty awesome thing to be able to do that. I mean, if, if you could have done that. But I just said, okay, my birthday is May 26. What is my year? And that's two years old. Yeah, it was good. I knew it wasn't well, like well, 76 I mean, or something. Yeah. yeah. And there's no way we'd know each other. Right, right, right. Because you're going out, right? You know, you're graduating. To, to, uh, 1984 was the year that that <laughs> happened in the parlor with Diana where I said, can I have your autograph? Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, right, right. Yeah. Let's document that. So I, I did a mentalist act on him. You're a mentalist. Play one on TV. No, it was a psychic demonstration if you want to believe it. But, but I'll be happy to explain it to him whether you want to document it or not. Yeah, I want to document it. What, what, what did I do? Okay, so he did something that was beyond coincidence, but it was just one thing. And if Penn or Teller were here, they go, you're not psychic. This stuff happens all the time, my friend. There's nothing unusual about it, but I will document it. When I was in the junior program, I, in the parlor, went up to Diana Zimmerman, who's the chairman of it, right after my audition. It was just she and three sponsors and me, and no one else was in the room. And I took a copy of The World's Greatest Magic, which she's in, and said, oh, could you sign it for me? And she made a joke and said, oh, you're definitely in this. Then when we connected for the first time 20 years later, Ken said, you asked for Diana Zimmerman's autograph. And I go, yeah, that's exactly right. It happened in that room. How the hell did you know that? And he's like, I'm psychic. So make of that what you will. That's pretty specific. But of course, then I said, okay, what are the lottery numbers? Make a five foot four blonde walk here right now. What is the next card in that deck in the shoe? And you couldn't tell me those things. So what good are you? Oh my God. That's a, that's a freaking tough crowd. I've got a tough crowd. A rough crowd. I mean, before the government steals you, if they can really do that shit, I'm going to steal you. And we're going to win the lotto. And we're going to watch the Bitcoin buy all the dick. Yeah. <laughs> okay. A piece of information that you couldn't have known. There's no way you could have known that. So. Uh, it, was a, it was a mental attack. I, I did a mental well, attack. No, it, it's a mental attack. Psychic. Yeah, well, whatever. I, I, I did a, think, I did a I mental attack. I think it was beyond coincidence. I was impressed. Yeah, well, and then you, did I impress you? Yeah, and then you impressed me again. <laughs> with, I'm still documenting. I can yes. go into this. Okay. I impressed him. You asked me, you interviewed a guy who got into your Uber car about what his favorite movie was. And there was a choice of five movies. 
and you'll find this interesting. He's sitting there on Zoom with me, and I go, you go pick one of these five movies, and I said, I forgot what I said, Die Hard or something, and you immediately turned the camera, and it was on a dry erase board, and it said Die Hard. Now, did you have five different dry erase boards? Did you have some program with... You're typing it in and it goes on. Oh! Or were you psychic? I don't know. But that was also... That was pretty damn good. I think the autograph thing was better. But yes, that was good while you're documenting this. That was good. That was good. That was good. I, I didn't... I didn't did I, re I have it on recording. Yeah. Yes, I have it doing it. Okay, but I'm thinking of a two-digit number right now. What no, no, I'm not going to do... I'm so you, random act right now. Like, like it, I was prepared... And I'm going. I'm sending. No, no, I'm not doing that right now. I'm not like on call. I'm, I'm, I'm not a, I'm not a. What do you call it? A monkey. A monkey. You know, on a tricycle. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. I, I did that to you. I have it on recording. Yes, I do. I have that on recording. As a mental assignment. I did that, right? Okay. And and I did the calling assistant. I was the I was the I did. I, I, I did. Um, I did. Uh, I did uh, metamorphosis. One, two, three, it's me. Yeah, you know, you know, I did that with like the yeah. I'll show it to you. I'll show it to you. Um, if, if we have time, I'll show it to you. But yeah. Okay, so I did that one. I did another one with you. Robert Dorian. Robert Dorian. Forgetting. Robert Dorian. What did I, I, you were talking about Robert Dorian. Okay, okay, listen, listen, listen. <laughs> Verify if this happened. I will. I'll okay, tell okay. nothing but the truth. Okay. Okay. So I am talking to a professional magician here. Are you a professional magician? He's <laughs> a professional magician. Pen and Teller? Fula. What was that? That's a, yeah, the show. Okay. All right. All right. I'm doing a magic act. Pen and Teller. We got Gangs Night here. Uh, mentalist. And you do a, a really good, uh, very intelligent mental attack. I did it. I did that mental piece. A mental piece. Mental piece. Right, right. But Robert Dorian is. Robert Dorian is. Robert Dorian is. Phenomenal. So I'm doing a, a mental attack. Let's do this. Okay. Uh, Robert Dorian. Robert Dorian. Uh, director of uh, the, one of the sponsors, head sponsors of the Junior Group, right? Yeah. Okay. So. He was talking to you, and I went, oh, he told me your experience when you were, he told me your experience when you were working with, with uh, Robert. Oh, about the Dorian. karate kid. And then I go like this, I go like this, I go, oh, he, Mr. Miyagi, you. Um, did I say that? Yeah, you did. So was, you and, I, and I said that's interesting because he made me go watch the karate kid for homework. Okay, that's kind of, that's not as impressive as the other two, but that's kind of weird that you would use that term, because he told me, go watch The Karate Kid and tell me what you learned from it, which I did, and he could have said anything, but he said a lot of things. Yeah, but I didn't talk to the guy. But you, you said that, and that's all you said. He Mr. Miyagi'd you. And now if you had gone into specifics and say, did I, he or did he not make you watch that movie, then I would have went, oh my God! <laughs> but you didn't do that. It's a tough crowd. It's a tough crowd. This well, is like well, the toughest crowd ever. We're going to document it. If you want to win the James Randi prize for, Holy what is shit. it, 10 million? Oh, um, no, he's dead. He's dead? Is yeah. he? Yeah. Yeah, he died. All right, yeah. well, you can still get the prize. No, no, he had no money. It was his bullshit. Okay. Yeah. If someone proved it, you can go to the FBI. No, no, no you can. But FBI hires psychics. They're not. They're not doing television shows. Psychics exist. All right. Yeah, they're, they're hired by the, the 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 police and FBI when they have a missing person. But they don't do a TV, They don't do shows. That's not what they're doing. They, they're actually telepathic. No, I met them. No, no, I've met them. I've met, I've met them. I've met them. Um, she stayed at our house. I, I bet she's the number one person. Sylvia Brown? The... No, 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 no. Her name is uh um what? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> this is cool.
<laughs> okay. That's cool though. That is cool. Sorry. Yeah. It's just lost the pain. Oh, psychic. Yeah. Psychic. Uh, psychic. Yeah. Okay, okay. So, so. Um. Uh, God, I forgot her name. She, she's a famous psychic. Oh, Dale Shear. No, no, Sylvia no. Brown. No, no, no. She's a, no. She didn't have a show. She worked for the for the uh, FBI. She solved like a couple of uh, 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 actual murders and stuff like that. She, she's a real psychic. She doesn't do television shows. Not that. But I would know her. No. You wouldn't. Uh, her name is Jamie Sam. She, she oh, I don't know her. Yeah, you don't know her. She's not a performer. Okay, but she's written all these books on being psychic, and and she remembers her uh, her last uh, 250 lives that she had lived in previous uh, incarnations. You know, legit psychic. Okay, and she works for she works for the, the uh, FBI. Okay. When they had a missing person, they come to her and they said, okay, and then she helps solve solve where the guy killed the person. Blah blah blah. She's a real psychic. Okay. 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 Um, She's one of those things. She doesn't do a show. I know. Yeah. But, but I mean, so she stayed with me okay. and Shara for 10 days. And, you know, I'm like going, okay. We have this friend, Brent, right? Listen. This woman is going to open the room tomorrow. You know that door? And I want to stay here. You said that about the psychic? Yeah. And she's the psychic, though. Yeah, yeah. You predicted what she's going to do. Yeah, and I go like, and she goes, Shara goes, oh my God. And she <laughs> she's just horrible, she's like, she's just 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 she was trying to do that, and it's like, whoa, whoa, everything's fine, everything's fine. Get her up, everything like that. Wow, so she didn't fake the injury, but you thought she would? No, and she was she was exactly doing that. She started, oh, 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 I'm coughing, all that stuff. Oh, my God. Isn't that crazy? Well, you never told me that. Oh, yeah, yeah. Jamie Sam, she's a famous psychic. Wait a minute, you have a video about her. No? Uh, I remember that name. Yeah, Jamie, oh, she's a famous psychic. She's, a real, she's a real one. Go ahead. Yeah, she's a real one. Anyways, I got I gotta turn this off. Soon. All right, say bye. What's up, dinner, folks? Bye. Hi. Bye. Here we are. We're at the castle. <laughs> Woo We're at the castle. Yeah. This, this was a crazy story. Um, yeah. So I did that with her, but that's hearsay. I just did that with you. you you're describing that it happened twice. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the other one was I sang a song. Right. And what was the song? Your. What was that song? It was your favorite country song. He happened to be favorite singing. country song. Is that was that your favorite country song? Popular country song. It is a popular it's country song. Coincidence, but yeah, it happens to be my favorite country song. And I sang it too. But I bet it's everybody's favorite country it song. It probably is. It's a famous country song. What did I sing? It said, you know, you know uh, really in all my roots, I showed up in boots. Really in your black face. You know, I, I sang, uh, I sang Garth Brooks to him. Right? Right. Did I see you in Garth Brooks? The Garth Brooks. See, uh, look alike. Uh, hey. Yeah, I, I sang with Garth Brooks. Yeah, uh, sorry? Okay, okay. 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 I'll, I'll talk to you soon. Bye. <laughs>